Today I have a Timu that I've had for almost two weeks and <laughs> I haven't done it. That's because you gotta put it together. <laughs> so I'm gonna try to put this together. If not, I might have to get Shea Bear to help me out a little bit. But we're gonna try anyways. So we're gonna open this up and we will be right back. Okay guys, so what I bought, it's a mobile printer stand it's for my printer i want it off the little bench that i have on the table there because i put it there and also my mom's equipment for the doctor i can put underneath because this has a shelf on it too so um then that way i can put the computer back up there so it's not sitting over here in the corner it makes the house look a little nicer so and this is what it looks like i don't know if you guys can see it there it is right there and we have to put this together i did pay i paid 59.20 for it but i got a price adjustment of four dollars and fifty cent fifty seven cents so i'm going to show you the picture of it this is what it looks like when it's all done hopefully and i need to open this up because i need to make sure there's nothing broken and i haven't even done that so we're going to open this up and see what's, what's all in here. So we're going to use Shea Bear's knife. Hopefully I don't hurt myself on it. And let's see what we can do. So... Mm, it's really tight. All right, there we go. Ugh. I'm going to have to put this on the floor. I'm going to have to move you guys. Ugh. All right. Let's try to see what we can do here. It is heavy. I had to drag it in the house to get it in when he dropped it off. He, he did it by UPS. I don't know. I hate to ruin the box if I have to take it back. Send it back. Then I can go back in this box. I don't know if I can get it out. Can you help me get it out, babe? very heavy he's gonna come and help me in the corner over here Maybe I'll have to cut the sides, but I didn't want to just in case I have to send it back. It's got a couple of tears on the back of it. Ooh. Wow. Is that nice? Two of these. Ooh, pretty. And two more. And these are the rails for the sides, I guess. And here, probably all your screws are in here. It gives you a screwdriver here. Shaver's getting it all out for me. And another panel 
through these. And, oh my gosh, got two more of these. Very pretty. I like the color. Here's the other one. <laughs> I'm getting them off the floor. And it gives you four wheels. So it is movable, which I like. So that will be good. So I'm going to get the other four wheels are way over there. Um, the other three, I mean. And we'll come right back. Okay, guys. So they give you a manual on your phone. I don't know if you guys can see that. Can you see that? There you go. So it has all the directions right here. Thank you for choosing our product. Please read this manual carefully before assembling. If the product is passed on to the third party, this manual has to be passed on along with the product. Enjoy your new purchase. So it shows you all your screws that you have right here that you're going to have. Let's see. There's your screws that's in that bag. And then it shows all your panels and that you got everything. So yep. please check and make sure all the parts and hardware are listed. Please do not tighten all bolts until the table is assembled completely. If you find that something is missing, please contact the store you purchase immediately. At least every four months. At least every four months. Check all bolts, screws, and knobs to be sure they are tight. <laughs> but check every four months. Who's going to do that? No one. Okay. So I'm going to try to <laughs> assemble this. <coughs> We're going to look at step one first. I'm going to read the step and then I'll come back. Okay, guys. So what we're doing, I think the numbers are wrong. They numbered everything, which is nice. But I think the numbers are on the wrong ones a little bit. So anyways, Shaver kind of helping me a little bit here. So you put these together. This is part of the drawer that you're going to do. And you do these two here. And this was F and this is I. So this is the front because this is going to be where the handle goes right here. So this has got to go on the side somehow. No. 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 You got a front and you got a back. You got a uh, front, back, and two sides. Right. So where's the other side? Okay, so I'm going to have to take the side. These in there. Oh. And that's where those other pieces come in. Oh. Like that. That's where the other pieces come in. All right. What are those? They're little clips. And they screw in there. How oh, neat. Well, you gotta make sure you get them right. Uh huh. I see your screwdriver. should fill it drop in there and it's not. Mm -mm. See that has to go you know pull this out. You don't have these screwed in all the way. You uh, screw these in all okay. the way. You gotta make sure they're screwed in all the way. You just start them and you're done. 
painting things. Probably why they tell you to check it every six months, because people do this stuff and they want to let their stuff get to it. Right. Now. Well, you starting with the back anyway. You can't do that. Let's start with the front. Line your slots up. This one here. See the difference? Uh huh. Has to be flush. Then see that horseshoe right there? Yeah. It has to go towards the head of that. And I don't think, I don't think you have that one screwed all the way in. Alright, but anyway. And you just turn that, it's like a quarter to a half a turn. Uh, I see. Okay. Uh -huh. There you go. And then turn it, it'll stop. And that's that. And that top one doesn't feel right. Mm -hmm. That one there, see? Mm -hmm. You don't have them tight enough. Uh -huh. See, that's tight. These only go so tight. This one needs to, yeah, see that one wasn't tight. Now let's put these back in here. Give it a turn. Give it a turn. There's your tight. Mm -hmm. You gotta do the same thing with this one. Don't put any pressure on that because it'll break right here. Mm -hmm. Make sure these are tightened. this. You gotta put that in there. I'll get you a couple more nuts. Okay. Alright, make sure your slot's lined up. Mm -hmm. Your slot where the drawer goes. Oh, inside. Yeah, this. Yep. Mm -hmm. I see. Um, I'm just saying, you gotta check it now or you'll have to take it Right. You don't want to do that. Right. There's one. Okay, so I'm going to turn it out this side. And we're going to put it in here. Goes in here. You make sure you got your horseshoe towards the head of that. Okay, that's so it goes down in. Yeah. You take your screwdriver and push it in like that. Mm -hmm. Now do this one. Make sure your horseshoe's lined up. Take your screwdriver, push it down in. Okay. Now turn it. Turn it. Yep. Keep going. You got to turn it, hang. Until it stops. Don't overdo it. So you feel that little click. Mm-hmm. That. Now, you got to put your drawer in. Or your... The back of it. It's not the, the bottom. Back, it's the bottom. It's the bottom. Okay. I don't think there's any sort of way. And I guess it's just whatever. And then the slide it. Yeah, I'm in there. In. All right, now we're on to this one. Oh, nice. So now we're going to put this. This is the back. Yes. Okay, so i got to line it up. How does it stay? Okay, well... Got it in there? Do you have it in there? Not there. Okay, well, first of all, you gotta have it. Uh, 
right. Now, same with them. Oh, I see. Check your horseshoe. So you want to make sure this is underneath the screw. So you got it down. Upside down? Yes. Fingers try to push it down with that. There you go. Now turn them. Yeah. Hear that click? Yeah. You have to hold your screwdriver like this sometimes. Uh huh. Like this. Oh, I'm being too no, dainty. No, wait, you're not. Yes. Okay. Not done yet. Mm -hmm. got those. You already put them in? Yeah, those were done. And okay. this, um, oh, this side. This side. Now turn it. Alright. Did you feel it? Mm. Did you feel that little little flip? That's done. Easy. Did you hear that click? Mm hmm Alright, your drawer is done except for the handle. Hey! Okay, so now we'll see what we got to do next, and we'll be back. Okay, guys, so we got these panels, got two of them, and what we're doing is putting the screws in the holes here. Already done the one. I'll show you. And you're just going to put these in like so. You want to screw them in, and then you want to screw them with your screwdriver here all the way until you see the black to the white. One more. Okay. So he's going to double check it. And this is the one that I first one I did. So we have them done. And I also, I did the handle. I didn't show it. It's easy to do. You just take your screws, put them on the other side, and then screw that in. So there's your handle for the drawer. So the drawer is done completely. And we're going to do those two sides. You don't use screw guns on these. No. Don't use screw guns on these, he says. Okay. Okay, so let's see. I will come back. I have to read and see what step three is now. We'll be right back. Okay, what we're doing is A and C. That is C he's got. This is H on here, but it's supposed to be J. They labeled them totally wrong. Mm -hmm. 
This is D. Uh huh. And I know it can't be this one. And it can't be that one, right? This is B. Okay, it can't be that one. So, we have an issue. Mm -hmm. This is like this. And showing that top hole. Mm -hmm. But the bottom hole cannot line up. See, they don't line up. Huh. Mm -mm -mm. Lines up the end two, two center ones. Mm -hmm. But according to the instructions, this ain't the way it's supposed to be. But it's the way, the only way it can be. Right. That's why it's supposed to look, guys. Huh. Still, I'm going to be missing one of these. Think so? Okay, so A, what's A? Is one of those A? No, these are A's. Those are the A's. Okay, so what's the way? This one go. You want to go with these up or down? Here, but it does. It doesn't go with these up or down. And this is down because the other ones are probably going to go in here. Right. right. Uh huh. Yeah. It has to go that way. Yeah. Because there's nothing else that can go. Up That's there. the way it goes.
you see me, you'll be checking their jigs and stuff. Yeah. I mean, if the numbers were on the right ones, it would have been not too bad. No. I'm talking about the way these fit. Oh. So, what's the next step? I'm okay. guessing the other side. Yeah. Well, that's the next step right there. Yeah, the other side, that other thing. Mm -hmm. No, that other thing. This one? The other thing. Oh, this? Yes, the other side of this. Thank you. Right. Step five. This one. So see, they don't tell you which way these are supposed to go. No, they don't. It's stupid. Yeah. These are E's. That's a C. And this is a B. <laughs> Will you hand me one of those, please? I just asked you to. Uh-huh. I want to go here. Okay. All right? Mm-hmm. That's what it's telling me to do. So which 
these are supposed to be these, and they're E's. Mm -hmm. I don't know what they're seeing. They're seeing you. They don't want to see me. Well, they're seeing part of you and they're seeing this. They got the whole thing in there. They're watching you. Okay, now wait a minute. Mm hmm. This has to be flipped around. Alright? Uh huh. This, this one here has to be flipped around. So, them screws, which they don't tell you in here, these screws have to be pointing towards each other. Oh, yeah? Okay. Oh. Right. Yeah. So because that was. Because of these. Because of the holes? Yeah, because these screws go in here and these ones are going down here. Oh. Uh, you put your keepers on. Huh. So we got to take this one out and flip it around. All right? Uh-huh. Okay, so. Which they don't tell you that. Why not? I don't know. That's why I, I told you I was wondering. Do these go this way or do they, you know? Right. They didn't say. Mm -mm. So. Now we know. So what we want to have to do is we got to put those in while we're putting this in. At the same time? Yes, because if you put these on, you can't get those in. Uh-huh. Follow me? Mm-hmm. So, there's a dog nose sticking out here. <laughs> He's a midship. He's got to know what's going on with Daddy Dog. He loves to watch you do work. If he could, he would do it himself. I know he would. Right, so now... This is what we got to do. See, like this. Uh huh. I don't know what they're seeing. Yeah, like they're seeing important. it. But they're seeing the whole thing. Okay. Uh mm huh. -hmm. So you just. You okay? okay. So now I'm going to set that like that. Uh mm huh. -hmm. These aren't lining up.
thing that sits together. And I can't. Oh, okay, my bad. Alright, so. I'm gonna flip it. Which they don't tell you. Alright. Can, can they see? Yep. Okay, so I'm going to put these on the inside. Right. Pull them on the inside. So what we're going to do, is set this one down for now. Okay. I'm going to take this. And it goes in those holes. It's supposed to. Uh-huh. But it's not. See, no. I'm going to take this one back out. Why you think that board has to be over there? Mm -hmm. Because it's got to be flipped. Like I said, they don't tell you this stuff. Uh-huh. See, there's more this way than that way. Oh. It doesn't tell you that. It mm. just shows you a picture of putting it in. Right. So, there's... What we got to do? I would never know that. How would anybody that, that doesn't know how to put this stuff together know that? They wouldn't. No. Uh-uh. So we have to flip these around. Yeah, it doesn't say they got to go a certain way. Mm-hmm. doesn't say that. It just shows a picture of putting it in here. It doesn't, you know, show you any orientation or anything like that. Just put this one in here. Yeah. Well, it doesn't even tell you that. It just shows a picture of it being there. Mm. But it doesn't show you pictures of which way this has to go. Which I'm assuming has to go like this. Since that has to go down below that. Uh -huh. That's why, see like here. There's more space here than here. Uh huh. And they do that because it has to count for that being there. Oh. And they don't, of course, they don't tell you that. You just got to figure it out. But see, this has got to drop down below that. Uh huh. When that happens, you know, it's not going to be right if you don't have that. You follow me? Yeah. Orientated correctly. Now, go like this. Okay. Right. Mm hmm. Did you hear that? Yes. You okay? I need. Because there's a screw hole here for some reason. There's one here for some reason. Why? See what I mean? Mm hmm. There's a hole right there. What for? This one's got to hold it. See? It doesn't tell you anything about that. No, it don't. The hole here. Yeah. And the hole here. Okay, now we know where these go, but what, what's that for? See what I mean? It doesn't say. So I gotta try to figure this out. Okay, there's a hole here. Hold on. That hole. That okay. hole. Right there. I'm going to put it like this. Because I think that's a pin to keep that drawer from coming all the way out. Mm -hmm. So 
going to put these in here. Of course, it doesn't say anything about that hole. But I'll, I'm sure it will tell you where to put the pin after you get it all together. And then if you don't have this right, you're going to go, damn, it's not right. You mm. know what I mean? Yeah. I'm going to slide these in here. Just like that. Mm -hmm. I'm going to do the other one. Same way, I want to orientate these pins with the pin holes. Right? Mm -hmm. So they're even. Just like that. Okay, I gotta screw this down. Take this. The long green's going to go that way. Mm -hmm. Ow. You okay? Well, I said they need to have somebody checking their jigs because the holes need lining up like they're supposed to do, and then people get hurt. Now, I'm gonna put screws in there and there. Mm -hmm. So I need four. Okay. Before I do that, I'm gonna put those keepers in there. Uh huh. If I put them in there, then these might not tighten down. If I put those two last two screws in, mm -hmm. or those last four screws in, might not tighten down. So, I'm just going to go ahead and put these in here. Make sure two of them first. Down the bottom, which is the back. Mm -hmm. Just like that. That was that popping in, mm -hmm. just like the drawer. Click. Yep, I heard it. Oh, I'd never figure this out on my own. Oh, I need these. Hmm. I'll go next to one of them. Some to use and some to lose, or what? Maybe. So 
some to use, some to lose. Yeah, I got it. It's supposed to be funny, Mama. Oh, ha ha ha! <laughs> Laugh, everyone. Okay. Now I can put these two in. Actually, four. Right. If I were to tighten them, mm -hmm. those things in here might not have tightened up right. Right. Because it wouldn't be able to pull them together. Ah. Uh, Which they don't, you know. They, they tell you tell you not to tighten everything until the end. That's what they say. Okay. Yeah, but that's a good way to forget something. Yeah, right. Some things have to be tightened before it's done. You can't build a car and just finger tight everything until the end because once you put a fender on, you can't, now I can't get that bolt. Right. And you forget about it. Why? Because the fender's covering it. Yeah. See what I mean? Mm-hmm. Yeah, well, they have different numbers on them. <laughs> huh? They have different numbers on e. them. Oh, this is E2 then. Yeah, so okay. this one, one goes up here, and mm -hmm. one goes down the bar. Okay. You can handle that, can't you? Mm -hmm. I have to stand up and take a break. That's fine, I can do that. Just got to look down in here and see that hole. Because mm -hmm. if you don't get in that pre-drill hole, these will split. Right. Okay? Mm-hmm. So you'll need two more down there and just stand on top. I got to take a break. No, these things are not easy. That's why I don't buy them too often. Yeah. Yeah. Okay. Yeah. Gonna do this one. Well, they had this all screwed up. I mean. Well, nothing was labeled correctly. No, nothing. Mm mm. Yeah. Somebody wasn't doing their job. Your quality control has a lot to be desired. 
Right. Yes. So you can go to the E, but if you go to the E snap, that's too far. The E snap. Don't grab that like that. There you, there you go, grab the Can I do it this way? Or should I lay it down? You know, if you've done a hundred of these, mm -hmm. you can use a screw gun. Yeah. If you're real careful. Right. You know, if you know about how much it takes. But if you've never done one before, mm -hmm. you're just going to keep screwing until it stops. It won't stop. It'll just stick out. Yeah. That's why they make the handles that everybody can win. They make these handles so small. Why? Because if they made them bigger, you got more cord to strip them out. Uh -huh. it's just Okay. Okay. Yeah, right. Maybe it's not the right way. Yeah. Now if you look down in there, you should be able to see that hole. Yep. So these two, you can go ahead and stick in and tighten. Okay. And then you can flip it over and do the other two. I don't feel that straight. Well, huh. Do you see this, the hole? Okay. There's the hole. Mm -hmm. Okay, start that one. I thought I was taking a break. You are. Mm -hmm. I ain't tighten it. Right. Just don't grab that hole. No. It's nap time for her. Mm-hmm. 
Here it goes. Probably. Well, I'm glad it has wheels because then I can move it around. Yeah, when you move it, it flips over. Because of the wheels. Because that's awful high and skinny. Uh huh. The center of gravity. Excuse me. Not yet. Almost. Yeah. Yeah, that's it. Okay, so. Alright, so the next thing is by the wheels. See, <laughs> give it this nut here. But I guess it's supposed to be to adjust for. So, you want to just screw these in? Are you recording? Yes. Okay, you're just going to screw these into this hole. They give you this stupid cork screen on here. And then. Do they have to go in a certain way? What do you mean? The wheels, like, or does it matter? I don't know what you mean. When you put it in the hole, does it have to face out, face in? Doesn't matter. <laughs> yeah, well, I would face have, them in, you know, so you don't trip on them. Because you have the brakes. That's what I was thinking. Yeah, but it will spin. <laughs> That's the problem you were thinking. I'll be quiet.
All right. Now, you for now also it doesn't tell you anything about them pins, does it? No, it doesn't. No. But I had to figure that out. Yeah. So, yeah. It says install fitting six and seven. In install the drawer as well. Uh, uh, I ain't kidding. That's what it says. <laughs> in install fitting six and seven. Install the drawer as well. Uh, all right. It does show you the pins. The pins are number eight, and there's no number eight up there. Ah. Wow. So these, what you do is if it's a little off balance, you can take this off and unscrew that a little bit, and that'll keep it from going so far down in. Mm -hmm. But if your floor is pretty level, just you know, screw them up there. And it doesn't matter if you put that wheel on like this or like this. Okay. Because it spins. So. And that's what you're going to do four times. Four times. Yeah. Four times four. It's almost time for me to start cooking. I know. I got chicken thighs yes. laid out. I'm going to boil them up. I'm going to put them in here for you. Well, that's my old boy. I figured you would. What's the weight limit on this? I don't know. I need to know before I get on it and have you push me around. You're not getting on it to be pushed around. There you go. I know, you almost screwed me up there. That thing would have been wobbling. Did you do the rest of them all the way down? I didn't touch them. Well, this could be interesting. I'm fired on a tune now, but I'm going to start. Right. So that's telling me one or two injectors are awesome. Mm hmm. There we go. Just that now. Put the drawer in. Okay. Now remember, we put those holes up here. Right there's one. Right there's one. So mm -hmm. what we got to do is put your drawer in first. And then we want to stick two of those pins. Oh, is that what those are for? Yeah, like the 30th time I told you. Oh, so you stick them in those holes. 
Yeah, just like I just said, you stick these pins in those. That's why I wanted to put the holes up here. Uh huh. Right? Yeah. So you'll see that hole there. I think they're the same, so it doesn't matter which way. I don't know if we'll be able to go like this or not. But I'm going to. Okay, so. There's one pin in. I won't do the same thing on the other side. Mm hmm. The drawer stop. So it don't fall out when you're pulling. Yeah. I'm going to put this one in here. Mm hmm. And they fit fitting loose. But see, that's to keep it from right. pulling all the way out. Also, these things here, these are these like little rubber plastic things now it said it came with them but we couldn't find them they were already in here so if you're missing them just check and see if they're already in there or not. Yeah. yeah we thought they were missing pieces here yeah. all right now i'm going to sit on here monkey's going to no, you're not. One of them's not spinning very well. Let's, uh, let's lock, but they do have locks on. Mm -hmm. So there you go. Thank you for helping. See, that kind of keeps it from Mostly doing, but thank you. You're welcome. I would have never figured that out. The numbers so were all screwed up. That's what the pins are for. Mm -hmm. So, you see, like I said, it doesn't tell you the orientation of them. No. I just thought, wait a minute, those pins are for something. What keeps the drawer in? That, and I had to figure it out. So if you put them down, yeah, you know, you wouldn't have any of those drawers from coming all the way out. Right. And you can take it out. Oh, it's nice. So the um, camera died, so I had to let it charge. So this is this is what I did. I put the computer back over here instead of being over in the corner. Um, cause I had all her stuff up there, but it was small enough that I could put all her stuff down here for her. This all goes to the office, um, her blood pressure and stuff because I monitor it. And then I have, um, my, um, yeah, you know, copy machine there. And then I have a drawer right here. I can put my stuff in there. And then I have a small little shelf down there that I can put something on so and I like it on wheels because when we put the Christmas tree up we'll put it here in the door in front of the window and I'll move this and I can just move it wherever because it's on wheels so I think this will work out just fine um yeah so there you go so I hope you enjoyed the video and um you know I have my ifs about it I mean, it's nice, it's pretty, it matches the, you know, the desk a little bit, um, you know, so that's a good thing. Um, not happy about the directions, I could have made directions a lot better, um, and labeled, make sure that they're labeling their products properly, um, so people can put this stuff together, but that, those are my biggest complaints. If I didn't have Shea Bear, I couldn't have done that on my own. There's no way. I would have been there still working on it right now. <laughs> or I would have got mad and <laughs> it would have been in the garbage can. So, um, yeah. So I hope you all enjoy the video and I'll see you in the next one. I have two things coming tomorrow um, that I can put together. Um, yeah. So... Another Timu thing is on its way. So that's it for now, guys. I'll see you in the next one. Mike Sushi's out. Bye, y'all.